While the muted colors of winter outside, browns and grays and dull colors, uh, can kind of flatten my attitude, I'm always brightened by coming in and seeing the bright colors in the church where Carolyn has fixed this uh, beautiful artwork for us and a reminder that spring is coming in some way. We have to go to the pages of scripture in order to experience a personal revival as well. And in Psalm 85, there is a revival that takes place, a plea for revival, and it begins with us. It begins within us as Jesus works in your heart to bring about that revival. Psalm 85, listen to the words of life. Starting in verse 6, Will you not revive us again, that your people may rejoice in you? Show us your unfailing love, O Lord, and grant us your salvation. I will listen to what God the Lord will say. He promises peace to his people, his saints, but let them not return to folly. Surely his salvation is near those who fear him, that his glory may dwell in our land. Love and faithfulness meet together. Righteousness and peace kiss each other. Faithfulness springs forth from the earth, and righteousness looks down from heaven. The Lord will indeed give what is good, and our land will yield its harvest. Righteousness goes before him and prepares the way for his steps. Let Scripture revive you today and give you that vision of righteousness and peace in Jesus Christ. God bless you.